guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, so I'm going to show you a few bits, well I say a few, quite a few, in other words a lot, don't know why I can't speak, um, things I've bought recently, probably over the last two months, maybe more, uh, some bits are from the sale, some bits were full price and um, yeah I'll show you what I've been buying. So before I start showing you what I've bought, um, I post most of my daily outfits and how I'll be wearing these things over on my Instagram, so if you want to go and check it out I'll put the tag on the screen here. Um, it's all at Emily and I post pictures of my daily outfits, food I'm eating, pretty much that really. Um, so yeah, if you'd like to go check it out, I will pop a link and I'd love to have you there. Don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> um, okay, so introductions aside, let me show you what I've bought first. So actually, before I forget, I got this jumper from Mango and I got this in the sale. I think it was 13 euros down from 26 and I had my eye on it for ages so... Um, yeah, I'm very glad that it went down into the sale and I managed to get it in my size. Uh, okay, so I'll start with earrings. So I got these from Topshop and these weren't in the sale, these were full price but I had um, a voucher so I got a bit of money off them. These are quite understated earrings which have, as you can see, diamantes all down the front and then these big tassels and yeah, I've been really loving tassel earrings and these are very cute indeed. Oh, and I got my Traegers pierced over Christmas as well, so that's cool and I'm excited to buy little earrings for that. Do you want to see? Is it weird showing you my ear? I don't know if it's weird showing you my ear close up. Do I need to put my ear on the internet? Probably not. But um, but yeah, so I'm kind of excited to buy a little piercing for that. And I don't know, I'm quite tempted to get my other Traegers done. What's the plural of Traegers? Traeguy? Who knows? Question of the day. Okay, so let's begin with new look. I finally managed to get the Fun Day jumper, which I've had my eye on for ages, and it was sold out everywhere, but I managed to find it on the Spanish ASOS website, so that was really good. And in case you haven't seen it already, even though I feel like it was everywhere, it's this really thin knit jumper, red, white, and it says Fun Day on it, so you can wear it any day of the week, as long as it's a fun day. And if it's not a fun day, wear the jumper, and hopefully it will be a fun day. Every day's a fun day when you're wearing this jumper. That little rhymes for free. Yeah, love this. Woohoo! Okay, so I got this, what I like to call my bin bag skirt, um, from New Look. I can't, for the life of me, remember what this material is called, but it essentially looks like a bin liner, but I'm, I'm kind of loving that. And I have the plain matte leather look skirt from New Look, and I've worn it so much that I thought I'd get the shiny bin bag version. And yeah, I've been loving wearing that too. This one fits a little bit, this one's slightly shorter than the other one, but you know, them's the brakes. Also from New Look, and I haven't worn this one yet so I can tell you the price, I got this other skirt which was £25 down to 12 and it's so so pretty. Again I'll show you in a cutaway. So it's this black skirt uh, with this lace overlay and black pom-poms all down the bottom. So basically you can kind of look like a lampshade um, at a really good price. Okay, so moving on to Stradivarius, which in case you don't know, is a Spanish brand um, that I think we have in the UK, but in Spain here, um, they're everywhere. And it's kind of similar-ish to New Look, I'd say, in a way, um, in terms of style and price point. So the first thing I'm absolutely in love with is this shirt dress. And on the hanger, I mean, it kind of does look like grandma's floral sack, um, in the best way possible. But this was $7.99, I remember that one, woohoo! Uh, this was $7.99 down from like 22 or something, so it was a pretty good saving. And I'm loving wearing this at the moment with over the knee boots. And it's got really nice floral details throughout. Um, except one of these buttons does that kind of poppy thing across the boobs, which is a bit, you know, of a pain in the butt, but you know, butt butt, double butt. But it's really pretty and I'm excited to wear this uh, in summer as well with bare legs and sandals. And then in winter I've been wearing it with um, over the knee boots and a jacket or I mean you could layer a jumper over this too. So yeah, versatile. Uh, so yeah, a few of these things I haven't tried on yet so when I do the try on section of this video it will be the first time I see them on myself so how exciting. Uh, I got these, I guess you'd call them joggers really, smart joggers from Stradivarius again, and these were, bum bum bum, 
$12.99 down from $17.99. So, saved a fiver. Not bad. Could be worse. And they're grey with this forest green stripe and a white stripe down the front. And I really look... I really look... I really look... Love the look of these, said Yoda. Um, I love the look of these with, like, a jumper and ankle boots or trainers and a t-shirt. I mean, you can really dress them up or dress them down, heels and a nice cami for a night out. So I'm hoping they look good on, and if they don't, back to the shop they go. And finally from Shredvarius, I got this t-shirt, which I'd had my eye on for a while. But again, I haven't tried it on, so I'm not sure how it's gonna look, but it's really cute. They only had size medium left, and it looks oversized anyway, so the small would have been better. Um, so I'm hoping it doesn't look too mahusive. But it says out of service with these really cute, um, colourful tassels on the front so I'm excited to walk and then you've got all the colour tassel action um, every day is a fiesta da, 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 da. Um, and yeah it says out of service so uh, some of these slogan t-shirts don't really make much sense do they I mean what's out of service me as in I'm tired I'm not working today I could settle for that um, but yeah I'm not I'm not really sure but I love the look of it and yeah, let's see how that looks on. Oh. Okay, so this is the white t-shirt. Sorry, I've got my uh, pyjama bottoms on. Um, but yeah, it is slightly bigger than I would have liked. This is a medium and a small would have been better. But to be honest, I don't really mind. Because it's really comfy. And I do like this detail here. And I think in summer when it's really hot and I don't want something quite clingy, this and a pair of denim shorts and like tucked in a little bit will be really cute. So I think for €8, Euros, it's pretty good. So if you saw my last video, I told you about how I got some over the knee boots so I've been keeping an eye out for things that will go really well with those um, and especially like the shirt dress ones I can wear uh, in winter and summer so I got this and again it looks kind of shapeless when I just hold it up to you but this was 18 down to 13 again from Shredivarius and it's this high neck grey jumper dress and I mean the material's quite thin which is good um, so, you know, you can layer it if you're cold, but you could also wear it if it's a bit warmer. And it comes down to about just above the knee. And I thought this, again, would look good with my over-the-knee boots. And then this is the kind of straight-down grey um, jumper dress. I like it. I mean, it is pretty shapeless, but obviously it's, it's quite short. So if you've got ankle boots on, it looks quite nice. But, yeah, I'm not exactly sure. I think maybe, like, with a bright lipstick it would look quite good and with a bright bag. But I'm not sure if I'm keen on the ooh, tight neck part. But then if I add kind of other bits of an outfit to it, like a bag and a coat, it's quite a good layer. And in the same vein, I got another dress. And this was 18 down to 13. And it's this gorgeous red with ruffled sleeves. Or shoulders, I should say. So you've got a bit of ruching going on there. And this one's a bit shorter and a bit tighter than the other one. And I absolutely love the colour of that one. So let's see how that one looks on too. Over to you, me. Uh, so this is the red dress. Uh, I hope you can see because it's snowing outside. I kind of wish I'd got a small now because at the time I thought, well, if it's a jumper dress, I might want to layer things underneath it. But I feel like maybe it's a little bit big. I don't know. Okay, so moving on to Mango. And Mango's really one of my favourite shops at the moment. I think they do really nice things. And... I don't know why, I feel like it's not as big at home in the UK, is it, is it not? Do you shop at Mango? Let me know. Jazz hands again. So, first things first, I got this jumper, which originally was 40 euros down to 35.99, down to 29.99, and then I paid 13.99 for it, so it jumped a lot in price. But it's annoying, it feels like it's a little bit itchy. And again, I did try this on quickly in the shop, but I had a t-shirt on underneath. So I feel like you don't really feel the true itchiness of a jumper until it's on your flesh. Don't know why I said flesh, I could have said skin, it would have been a lot less creepy. Anyway, <laughs> anywho. Um, so yeah, it's this high neck jumper, black and white stripes, like a zebra, uh, with gold buttons down the shoulders. And it's quite oversized, and it has these big balloon sleeves for all of your soup dipping needs. Because if you can get away without getting food on your sleeves while you wear big sleeves, then I'm sure, I'm, I'm pretty sure there's some sort of medal there involved for you. So this is the jumper. 
I like it, but I think I'm probably going to return it because it's really itchy. And I think the way the stripes go thin and thick is actually quite unflattering. So, yeah, I kind of look like the marshmallow man. Oh, I forgot something from Stradivarius. I bought these studded ankle boots. And these were a bit of a steal, actually, considering they're leather. I mean, I don't deliberately look for leather boots, but I tried these on and they kind of happen to be leather. So, but yeah, they are these studded ankle boots, uh, which, as you can see, are black with the silver studs all around. And these were 70 euros, which I think originally, for kind of Stradivarius's pricing, seemed kind of expensive for that shop. Um, but they are leather, so I'm, I'm not really surprised that they were a bit more. Uh, and they feel to be made really well, which is... Good. Nobody wants soggy toes. Okay, and then the last thing I got from Mango was this dress. And I really love this dress. It's so pretty. If I showed you first, it might make a bit more sense. So it's this red floral number with short sleeves, which kind of um, flow out. They're like little bell sleeves. And you can tie it around your neck if you want to, like that. But it's optional, you know, don't feel the need. And it comes to just below the knee-ish, but it kind of has a slip at the front with these buttons all the way down. And this was a bit of a bargain, if I do recall correctly. Yeah, it was 40, down to 20, down to 13. And again, I saw this when it was full price, so I was quite excited to get my hands on it. But the only problem is, I had to get a medium, and normally I'm a small, but I tried this on, and um, and the small was doing that kind of weird gapey boob thing, and, you know, it's not not quite the look I'm going for. And I don't even know why it was doing that, because normally I'm kind of okay and it doesn't do that, because my breasts are small and humble. So I can run for cover when I'm needed. I uh, promised myself I wouldn't Shakira in this video, but, you know, she comes out sometimes. Okay, so finally, um, on to Pull and Bear. Now, I feel like this jumper's going to be a little bit love-hate, a bit Marmite. But I love Marmite, so, you know, don't know why I needed to declare my undying love of Marmite. But, yeah, so, it's this jumper, which has kind of borrowed the sleeves of, a, of an animal. Um, it looks quite sheep-like, quite shaggy. And I tried this on ages ago, when it was full price. It went down to... 15 from 20. Ooh, them the savings. Um, and I did a poll on Insta stories about if people liked it or not, and it was it was pretty much split down the middle. So yeah, I think you either really like it or absolutely despise it. I feel like I'm a bit on the fence about it. I don't know. I really liked it when I tried it on. Oh, just kicked my makeshift tripod. Um, I liked it when I tried it on, but I'm um obviously I'm gonna try all these things on and return the things that I don't really like or love enough to keep. Um so I'm just I'm going to try it on, and if I can think of enough outfits I'd actually wear it with, then keep it. But I don't want it to kind of sit there and be one of those things that I like but never really wear, if you catch my drift. But yeah, let me know in the comments, what do you think? Does it look like I've just, you know, taken the legs off of a sheep and sewed them to a vest? That sounds quite morbid. Or do you think it's, you know, funky fresh? Who knows? It reminds me of something Lizzie McGuire would wear, um, with like some sort of vile... Um, I don't know, neon tie-dye skirt. I can't honestly say I hate that look. Um, so yeah, this is a no. Um, I think it's a bit, just a bit too fluffy. I think if it was a bit thinner on the arms, and if the arms were the same colour as the actual top, it would be better. But I just feel a little bit like an endangered white gorilla, and that's kind of not the vibe I'm going for, so back to the shop it goes. And then lastly, I got from Pull and Bear again a shirt dress. And I bought this in two sizes because I was a bit... Oh. They seem to be at war with each other. Um, so I bought this in two sizes because I couldn't uh, decide on which one looked better. So I thought if I just bring it home and try it on with everything I'd wear it with, um, I could decide then. So I got it in a small and a medium. And it's this shirt dress which was... Uh, 19.99. Da New currency, $19.99 down to $7.99. And it's your standard blue and white shirt with short sleeves. And it's longer at the back and shorter at the front. So yeah, it's a really pretty shirt dress. And I thought for eight euros, that was a bit of a steal really. And I thought, you know, 
again it would look nice with over the knee boots and maybe a jumper on top like a cream jumper um but then again in summer with like a big sun hat and sandals it would look really cute so let's see which one was better the small or the medium so this is one of the shirt dresses on um and yeah i like the look but i don't like the fabric it feels really kind of thin and cheap and even though it'd be good for summer um it's kind of creasing a lot and I don't know. But I don't know, I feel like it's one of those things where like even with a belt, like it kind of, if you keep moving it, it looks right and then, I mean if you move in a weird position it kind of sticks. So I don't know, I like the idea of it but I think I'll return these and just look for a better one. Okay, so that's everything. Thank you very much for watching and yeah, let me know in the comments below what was your favourite, what should I keep, what should I take back, maybe you think everything was hideous, maybe you think everything was great. Who knows? But yeah, I love when you actually return something you don't like and you kind of forgot you spent the money on it and you get money back in your bank and you're like, oh, I'm rich! And you're like, no, that's just the money that went out a while ago. Um, and reality hits. But anyway, thank you very much for watching um, and I hope to see you around these parts sometime soon. Bye!